Hello friends, it's Julia Simpson, Kia Babies brand spokesperson. So happy to be back with you again for another Amazon Live. As you can see, I have a smorgasbord of products to talk to you about today. Kia Babies products, of course. Um, this room right now basically represents my life at the moment um, because I am just returning from vacation. Let me rephrase that. I am just returning from a trip <laughs> with my husband, our extended family, and our sweet 10-month-old daughter, Sophia. I read a quote somewhere that whenever you are traveling with a baby, you are not on vacation, you are on a trip. Um, and man, I have to say that's pretty accurate. Um, I, I can't say that I'm totally refreshed and rejuvenated, but uh, I am certainly so grateful and so joyful that we were able to do this uh, with our daughter, that we were able to get away for a little while, spend time with family, which we haven't been able to do really since the pandemic started well over a year ago at this point. My gosh, that's crazy. Um, we made so many memories, took so many pictures. Was it always easy? No. Um, sleeping away from home is always tough for a baby. Um, packing for a baby can get really stressful. Um, and then of course there was the aspect that I had so much anxiety about and was literally dreading, no exaggeration, I had actual dread about the car ride. Um, we did go on a road trip. It was about five and a half hours one way, which in the grand scheme of things is not really that bad, but um, Sophia is not a huge fan of her car seat. She hasn't been since she was a newborn. We have just not been able to change her mind about that. Um, five and a half hours is a lot for a baby. Um, so I will say that the trip was made so much smoother, so much less stressful, thanks to the Kia Babies On The Go collection. Now, if you don't know, the On The Go collection includes items like the original diaper backpack, um, the baby wrap carrier, the multi-use cover, uh, the car seat mirror, and the easy changing mat. Um, all items for the most part that I've talked about before. Um, however, in this video, I, I've never talked about them together as a collection. Um, I've talked about kind of the individual items and how I've used them in everyday life. But now that we've taken our first real trip, I can actually talk about um, how we used them on the go. Um, so a lot of this will actually be new. Um, so I hope you stick around. We've got a lot of ground to cover. And um, I just want to share with you how Kia Babies can make your summer trip <laughs> or summer vacation um, a little bit easier. So let's get to it. The first item I want to talk about is the baby car seat mirror, just because this was a new item for me. Um, I started using it for the first time just before we left for our trip. Uh, and I have it right here to show you. Um, but I also have one that has not been unboxed yet. This is the one we used on our trip and are still using in our car. Um, and I did want to do an unboxing with you really, really quickly, just because, um, in case you've never shopped with the brand before, I want you to know what to expect when you order. And of course, Kia Babies all, always includes little extras in their packaging, um, that I just love sharing with you. So let's go through this. We've got the baby car seat mirror. Um, I do want to point out to you, always check out the back of your box because there are links to find us on our social media. We love connecting with you. Um, share your photos, share your experiences with our products, ask questions if you'd like. Um, so please find us on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and Pinterest. And on our Instagram, especially if you are not following, we do lots of fun giveaways. Um, we you know, share your personal stories that you send. It's just a great way to connect. So please go follow us on Instagram. Uh, let's open this baby up. Here we go. Gonna take it out of the plastic here. And as always, right on top, we've got our happy little surprises. So as a thank you for shopping with Kia Babies, they always include a special gift for you. There is a QR code or a link for you to redeem. So please don't throw that out. Take advantage of it. 
this i love this a sticker for the car i know some people are on the fence about these i personally love them because when i have my baby in the car i am driving super cautiously i know you are too um i tend to you know stick to the speed limit maybe go a little under the speed limit if she's sleeping in the back i'm avoiding potholes that kind of thing so i want the people around me to be aware that this is the reason i'm essentially driving like an old lady so this says please be careful baby on board i think that's such a nice touch if you enjoy those and of course there's an instruction manual to show you exactly how to install your mirror which we'll go over a little bit and uh, just show you what it should look like so that's that let's look at this color here you have two color options this is matte black and let's go ahead and pull the protective cover off boom love this oh I just showed you the mess in here sorry about that Looks like this, so this is the matte black. Um, the one I'm using here is the sleek black. You can see it kind of has a sheen to it. Either way, these are so sleek and stylish. Um, in my car, I have faux leather black interior, and this is gonna just look really stylish and conspicuous no matter what the interior of your car looks like. Um, turn this around so I'm not like blinding you with the light. Yeah, you can see the you can see the mirror side there. Um, a few things about this. So this is definitely um, one of the larger car seat mirrors that I've used in the past. I think this is eleven and a half by seven and a half, so definitely sized large. The one we were previously using was one of those like super colorful, small plastic mirrors. It's got like the built-in toys all around it. I hated the way that looked in my car. Um, which would have been fine if Sophia were like obsessed with the toys and really enjoyed that. But honestly, she could never really reach them and her own reflection is her favorite thing to look at. Um, so this is perfect for that. <laughs> this is what she would rather be looking at. Um, so with this larger surface area, you've got an unobstructed view of baby um, from the driver's seat which I love, so important. I'm not having to like crane my neck around, I'm not having to turn around, adjust my mirror constantly so that I can see her. It means my eyes are staying on the road um, and it's just so much safer, so much safer than what we were using before, which had really, really low visibility. Um, speaking of the unobstructed view, I love this. So this um, ball hinge mount on the back here means that you can turn the mirror 360 degrees so if you keep it horizontal, of course, you're going to get a view of baby kind of here up and good visibility on the sides. Um, if you hold the mirror and turn the mirror this way, um, you've got full view from here down to about baby's waist. And I personally prefer that because um, I like to be able to see kind of what Sophia is doing back there in her car seat. Of course, we never leave anything unsafe in her car seat with her, but she does have car seat toys um, that she likes to play with. And, you know, just sometimes when it's just me and her in the car and she gets a little quiet back there, I like to be able to just glance up and see exactly what she's doing. It gives mama peace of mind. I'm sure you can relate to that. So I love that feature. Um, also, with this mount, you can hang um, toys and things like that if that's something that your baby also enjoys. So it's not like you're, you know, losing out on the um, ability to include something for baby to play with. Um, so there's that. This foam padding here on the back actually stabilizes the mirror. So you're not going to get a bunch of crazy shaking while the car is in motion. It's also not going to like slip slide around, fall out of place when you go over a speed bump or a pothole or something like that. Um, I can definitely say there is like none of this, um, which was also an issue with the previous mirror we were using. So I love this. Uh, these are reinforced straps. So this baby is staying in place. And what I mean by that is you've got this extra stitching here um, that just makes this good and sturdy and strong. So no, no fraying, no breaking, no coming apart. You've got these plastic buckles here. Um, I always say that you can always tell a lot about the quality of a product uh, anytime they use these kind of plastic closures. Um, by how easy they are to open and close. And as you could see, that was like butter. 
Um, so these are great, super durable. Again, this thing is staying put, so you don't have to worry about it like falling off or toppling down on babies. Certainly not gonna happen. Um, it is completely shatterproof. It has been crash tested, so you know it is good and safe to use. Um, I just can't say enough about this. It is a travel essential, certainly, because um, on the way down, I sat in the back seat with Sophia, so I was able to keep an eye on her and what she was doing. So this was really like a source of entertainment for her. She's learning to mimic, making faces at herself, waving, um, just kind of watching the world go by, kept her quiet for probably an hour or more, no kidding. Um, and then on the way back, uh, from our trip, I was driving and my husband was in the back seat with her and she loves Dada, but she is going through a bit of separation anxiety with Mama. Um, she does not like when she can't see me. So with this view, uh, it was a great way for her to me to keep an eye on her, but her to also be able to keep an eye on me and know that I am still there just because I'm driving, I'm still close by. Um, and you know, we could like talk back and forth to each other and that kind of thing. So if you have a babe that kind of gets nervous in the car or gets some separation anxiety when you can't be back there interacting, you absolutely need this in your life. So again, these are the two color options you have, matte black, sleek black. Um, all items that we talk about are browsable. You can see your color options and all of that right down below this video. And if you want to shop right here on Amazon, just click on the product and click add to cart. It's as simple as that. So please keep that in mind as we're talking. So I'm going to set this aside and I am in desperate need of unpacking. <laughs> Um, my laundry room is actually right next door to the studio here. So this is kind of a great opportunity to go ahead and unpack our clothes and some, some other things, um, while I'm down here. And while I'm doing that, I thought I could, uh, show you the other travel essentials from the Kia Babies on the go collection that we took with us, but I'm going to be unpacking them from my original diaper backpack. So <laughs> bear with me. Um, gonna go over a, a lot of things. Uh, I will show you, of course, the bag um, all packed up. And as I'm unpacking it, you know, I can explain what everything is, how I like to use the bag. And then of course, once it's empty, I can really give you a great view of the inside and all the pockets and all of that good stuff. So let's get to it. All right. Um, the first thing before I get into my bag, actually, let me unpack this bag. I have two bags to unpack. Okay, so um, my probably a holy grail item for me on any trip from now on is going to be the easy changing mat because boy, it is so much more than a changing mat, let me tell you. Um, it's I have it right here in gray. It also comes in geo black. Um, I switch out which one I'm using uh, from time to time, just depending on like what mood I'm in. Uh, so the gray one is the one that I have all packed up for you today. I use this primarily in the car. Um, so the way that I have it hanging up here in the car, I hang it from the little pool bar, uh, the little safety bar thing on my side uh, in the back seat and I keep it all closed up nice and tight like this so it's not encroaching on my headspace. But it makes on the go diaper changes when you are on the road so much easier. Let me just show you. So imagine this is hanging in the car, right? So I just unsnap to open it up. I've got my diapers, my wipes, and my diaper cream here. So let's pull that stuff out. Oh, drop my diaper cream right there. Easy access. I'm gonna detach the changing pad. So I was able to unfold this, lay it down in the back seat. Of course, we're stopped. We're not moving when any of this is happening. Um, but you know, I don't want to have to get out of the car. I don't want to have to unpack our big backpack. So that's why this was just so, so great. Um, you've got this lovely foam padding. So it's nice and comfortable for Sophia. It's got wings even to support her arms. So we toss, uh, toss this down in the back seat, lay her on it, get the diaper change all done. And I can just fold it right back up and reattach it and hang it back up again for the next one. Also, 
this, uh, there were times on the trip when Sophia just kind of hit a wall, you know, um, it's unnatural to be like in a sitting position <laughs> for five and a half hours, especially for like a squirmy baby who's got a lot of energy to get out. Um, so we had pre-planned to make a couple of stops along the way so that we could get out, um, you know, to eat lunch out or just take her for quick little walks. Um, at a rest stop or a park or things like that. We did that a couple of times. And this is what I used for our on-the-go bag for those short little trips. Um, I wanted to keep our big backpack nice and packed in the car. Um, you know, we've got a lot of stuff packed in it for the trip. We were using it as Sophia's luggage. So to pull it, you know, out every single time we just did these quick little stops would just be really inconvenient. So in here, in this front pocket, I keep Sophia's sunglasses, her sun hat, and then I would throw our like cell phone and car key in here as well, zip it up nice and secure, and then I've essentially got a shoulder bag with everything I need. It can also serve as my purse. So, so convenient. Um, so I definitely highly recommend traveling with the easy diaper changing mat. Um, and remember, it also serves as a full diaper bag. So I feel like I'm selling it kind of short, calling it the diaper mat, right? Um, so that is definitely on my list of travel essentials. Again, um, remember everything is linked below and you just hit add to cart if you want to shop. So now let's get to our original diaper backpack, the big boy here. Um, I'm holding this one in navy blue. This is the one we used on our trip. I've got it in wine red and mystic gray. Uh, you can check out all of your color options below or on the Kia Babies website. Um, here, let's actually start on the side pockets because it's the easiest thing to unpack. So over here, I traveled with um, a container of water for Sophia to drink and a container of filtered water here so that we could make bottles for her. She is on formula on the go. So go ahead and get those things out of the way so I can open this nice and big. I'm gonna open this up and show you the inside now. <laughs> Please do not judge my personal packing skills my husband is, believe it or not, the packer in our family. He's also the gift wrapper. I don't know. I just like wasn't born with that gene. Um, but the fact that like we got basically an entire week's worth of items for Sophia into this bag and I still have room at the top proves like just how spacious and versatile and awesome this bag is. Um, so let me go ahead and pull out the other life-saving item we used in the car. So this is the Kia Babies multi-use cover. It can be used as a nursing cover. Um, it can be used as a car seat cover, which is how we used it, um, which is why it's one of my travel essentials. And you can see some of the other colors we've got here. Um, these two gray patterns and a little pop of color in there. Um, I think the blooms pattern is my personal favorite. Um, but this is the one Sophia likes for whatever reason draped over her car seat. So Sophia has a lot of trouble napping on the go, napping away from home. This is so perfect for draping over the car seat. You just find the opening here. So your car seat handle pokes out of the top. Um, this is how I was able to provide her a little darkness, a little shade. Um, we traveled with a portable white noise machine and it was the only way she was able to kind of downregulate her nervous system a little bit and actually drift off to sleep. So this is definitely one of my travel essentials, the multi-use cover. And of course, if you are a nursing mom and you're you know, making stops along the way um, on your road trip, this is going to come in handy for that as well. So there's that. Um, when we would get out at our um, little stops, to walk Sophia around. We didn't wanna to have to pull out our big, heavy, bulky stroller every single time. Plus, whenever um, anything is kind of different or new in Sophia's environment, like when we're traveling away from home, she gets extra clingy, which is totally normal. And you may notice this as well when you travel with Babe. Um, they're excited to explore new surroundings, but they wanna stay super close to mom and dad. 
Um, so baby wearing when you are traveling is an excellent idea. It can be a lifesaver. Um, so that's something else I'm pulling out of this big front pocket here. Um, it's another one of my travel essentials from Kia Babies. It is also an everyday essential for us. It is the baby wrap carrier. Now I'm gonna toss it on really quick, um, give you like a really quick tutorial in case you haven't seen our video on this before. Um, but I did wanna point out I've got the classic gray and then there are three other colors back there. This actually comes in 11 different colors. So please check that out on the Kia Babies website. Um, all right, let's put this on really quickly. I'm gonna move this so I don't trip. Move this. Okay, we love this thing. So you wanna find the center and you have this Kia Babies logo here that brilliantly tells you exactly where that is. So I'm gonna put that against my tummy. Crisscross in the back, bring it up over my shoulders. I like to go ahead and spread it out. Make an X. Tuck, tuck, crisscross in the back, come on around the front, tie off the excess. Okay, so I'm going to use a stand-in for my baby today because um, I wanted to be able to move through all of this quickly and who knows when she's going to cooperate. Um, <laughs> she has a mind of her own these days, so we're going to use little Sploot the cat. So what you're gonna do is you hold baby here on this side, the side of the X that's closest to your body, tuck baby in. Make sure they're covered from the back to the kneecap. Repeat on the other side. Spread this out on my shoulder a little more. You wanna make a good cozy seat. Of course, Sploot is very light, so this doesn't work exactly the same as it would with your real life baby. Then you're gonna tuck, tuck, and you wanna find, ah, where'd it go? The logo, so that you know you're wearing it correctly and that baby is good and snug, tuck under the bottom, and there you go. So this was how we did our little stretch our legs walkabouts. Um, Sophia got the cuddle time that she needed, you know, in the car seat, she's not getting like the interaction and the touching that she is used to at home. Um, so this was just a really great thing to have uh, while we were traveling and just kind of putting her through so much change and things she's not used to. Um, this was also a great way to get her to sleep um, once we got to our house that we were renting because, again, she has trouble sleeping away from home. So that is another travel essential. Please don't pull your baby out by the neck. <laughs> um, okay, so moving on, let me just show you some other neat things. Sit back down so I can give you a good view of the backpack here. Okay, so probably my favorite pocket of all on this thing is the insulated pocket right in the front because this holds your bottles and your snacks, the thing that baby needs to eat. And when my baby is hungry, she is hungry and there's no time to mess around. So we packed two, um, you can see really good sized bottles here. Um, two is all we really felt like we needed. Um, we just kept washing these out and reusing. I used this other insulated pocket to pack some snacks that needed to stay cold. So like a yogurt pack for her and then she had her little puff cereal. Now, another Kia Babies item I absolutely love. Is it a holy grail, like you have to have it for travel? Not necessarily, but is it handy to have? 100%. So I've got it tied together here with a rubber band, um, and that's because I tuck 
Sophia's eating utensil. So her little spoon here inside the food catch pocket. So, so convenient. Um, this is a silicone bib. It's nice and soft and pliable. So Sophia actually enjoys wearing it. It's not uncomfortable. So, so easy to clean. You just dump out the excess food. This is if you're at home, of course. Um, flip it inside out and rinse it under the sink. Or if you're out on the go, just giving it a wipe down with a wipey um, works just as well. In this front pocket here, I kept some of these boogie wipes. Um, whatever wipes you have are gonna work just as well. So super easy to keep clean even on the go. Um, and of course, because Sophia was never left unsupervised in the back seat, this was also great um, to use as like a snack holder. So we would just pour some of her puff cereal in here. Um, and this was another thing that kept her occupied. She would just pull it out from here and eat in her car seat on the go. And it was another thing that kept her occupied. So, so many uses for this. Uh, this is the Kia Babies silicone bib. I have the cotton candy pack, which is this purple color, and then this sweet pink here. So please check that out. We'll make your life so much easier. Inside here, I've got diapers on one side. I've got wipes and diaper cream on the other. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this stuff out. Because it's high time that I am packed. Okay, there we go. In this pocket here, I've got Sophia's SPF. We travel everywhere with that. Um, I have a container of formula for her. As I said, we had to mix on the go. Now let me just show you this big main pocket, how much it was able to hold. So we've got a sleep sack. We've got two pairs of pajamas. We reuse pajamas in our life. We've got five whole outfits for her. Actually, this is six outfits here. Six outfits, so that was one for every day that we were gone. I brought books and toys that she loves either for the car ride or you know to keep her occupied once we got to our rental house look at all that space nice handy pockets here two on the side now in here up top we've got a zipper pocket I use these little reusable silicone bags. Uh, try to cut down on plastic as much as possible. Um, I keep that up top with um, some baby Tylenol and some cold teethers because you always want to have sort of a little medicine pack or a first aid pack for baby when you're on the go, just because you never know how they're gonna be feeling. This second pocket down here, and I'll actually show you a back side view of that pocket. Another reusable, reusable silicone bag, and in here we kept her toiletries and her self care items. So we've got some lotion, a toothbrush, a hairbrush, and some sample size body wash and shampoo that she uses. And the reason I like to keep it in this pocket down here is because it is completely waterproof. So if any of that stuff spills, the bag is not getting soaked, it's not getting yucky. Um, that is my, my tip for you. Anything that you want to stay contained and not cause a mess anywhere else in the bag, use that waterproof pocket. Now the entire bag is scratch and waterproof. And I did wanna show you on the back side here where you have access to that pocket and to the inside of your bag, right in there. Love that you have two points of access to this bag. And let me tell you, when you are 
trying to pull things out of this on the go, on the road, you know, it's probably like in your floorboard in the car and you don't want to be fumbling around with it. This totally eliminates that because you've got two openings here and on the back side. So is this a travel essential? Oh my gosh, 100%. Um, as you can see, it's more than a diaper bag. Uh, it also functions as uh, a piece of luggage where you can pack everything you need for baby for the entire trip. Um, so yes, we love this. Please browse below, hit add to cart to shop. I've got a lot to do. <laughs> Um, but yes, thank you so much Kia Babies for making our experience as smooth as it could possibly be. Um, all of these are my holy grail travel products. Products I think you should have in your arsenal if you are planning to travel with baby. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I hope I piqued your, your interest and your curiosity um, about these products. Again, everything is shoppable right here on Amazon or please check out kiababies.com if you haven't before. Um, I will see you next time. Keep creating wonderful moments and best of luck if you are traveling with baby this summer. Bye friends.